there's no doubts about that I'm on the right path. It looks like my whole life is leading up to, you know, this. You know, the 10 years in internet marketing is to be used for good. What will help humanity rather than harm it? So the guardians of this planet versus the destroyers of this planet. To make sure that I'm leaving a legacy and make sure I'm living in alignment to my soul. How can we work together to make this happen so that it's a win, 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 win for all? I've got to look at the broader picture, not just individuals. I've got to look at what, what we can really do to make a big difference to the lives of millions or hundreds and what I, what I want my daily life to look like. You know, do I want my daily life looking like someone sitting in front of a computer? No, I want to get out there and travel. I want to get out there and do things. What changes do I need to make for what we are doing where sitting in front of a computer is not the main part of the job because ugh, that's just another enslavement, <laughs> another trap, another place to keep us in this one tiny place when there's a whole world to explore and thinking long term, thinking how this affects generations, how this affects not just people in the movie screen now but people that we meet on an everyday basis and their, you know, and bigger picture, bigger picture, big, bigger picture, where the vision is going and I want to explore all that so that I've got this expansive view of what we can achieve together and then I'll be able to share that vision and really changing the ripple effect in the collective consciousness, like really making a, a difference, getting people out of the matrix, getting people out of the system, helping people out of the system because they need alternative ways of living and that firstly they need to get out of the stuckness that they are and generally that's money related. Generally they're stuck because they're on the treadmill not getting anywhere. And so I think it does start with giving them back their power so they're not reliant on um, banks and corporations and bosses and out of survival mode and into creative mode. So getting, knowing that they're okay without the system. I think that's where we're all at. I think that's what our calling is to do is to make sure that people, they're, they're safe, they're secure and then they can follow their passion and give their gifts to the world and that can also be part of the same system that they were creating, using the system to create a system that helps people shine again and do what they came here to do. This system is really, it's been going on for a long, long time and it's going to be hard to change it, but it first starts with, you know, like if you have no belief in yourself, you're never going to, you're never going to do it. You've got to be willing to um, raise your head above the crowd. That's a work in progress for all of us, especially myself, but I can recognize that's where my blockages are. So if I recognize that I'm holding myself back by keeping myself so small and insignificant when I know that I have a lot of things that can help a lot of people and I know that people that I meet have got so much that could help a lot of people and you know if I can help those people who are able to help a lot of people get their information out there then I'm helping other people by helping other people who are helping other people and I've just got to not be sucked into the system that keeps us so freaking small.